Welcome back to Google Guru. Today's video is brought to you by Kirksville Web Design. Hi everybody, this is Kyle with another Google Science video tutorial. This one's going to cover the um, brand new feature to embed a Google Drive folder in Google Sites. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that really quickly. So go into edit page mode and then you're going to want to go to the insert tab in the menu here above the toolbar and you'll see uh, under the Google subheading we have down here now folder. This is brand new so you click on a folder. Now you got to use this in conjunction with Google Drive. So you set up your Google Drive folders uh, as I have. I have like an example folder here that contains several documents. So I'm going to go ahead and select that and I'm going to change the display of it. So I'm going to make it a thousand pixels wide and 300 pixels high just because that's uh, all I need there. And I'll hit save. And you can just, you know, tell really quickly uh, that this is a very nice feature because you can keep all your documents, you know, in the same Google Drive environment, not have to make many file cabinet type pages. So that's why it's uh, really handy. You can add these descriptions here. Let me show you how to do that real quickly too. I'm going to open up a new tab here, go to drive.google.com and I'm going to go to that, uh, that sample one I was using here, example folder. Okay, and then uh, you can see here it's the exact same look to it. Now how did I get those descriptions on there? Well, I selected the document, I went to the more button, and went to details. And you see here it brings up this right side panel, which uh, explains here's the description. So you can write down a description to accompany your documents uh, and help describe what they are. So it can be very helpful for, you know, for others if you have like a project type site, you know, to describe what, uh, what a document's about. So just a really quick tutorial. Hope you guys found it informative and can take advantage of this new feature in Google Sites. Thanks again. Bye.